Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Um, wow, Glenn, should I be honored that you attempted to, uh, well, uh, give me a false copyright strike to begin with? I mean, uh, you haven't been very active on your channel, uh, as of late anyway, so why are you so pissed off with one of my videos anyway? But seeing as how that you, uh, just took down one of my videos temporarily, I figured I might as well put up another one about you. Now, a little bit of backstory to this one. I know this particular video is at least two years old, but it's the memory of me first watching a Frauditor video that really got me into uh, wanting to expose these idiots. And this is one of uh, Glenn's classic videos right here, and in fact, was my very first video that I ever watched of a First Amendment auditor, a.k.a. Frauditors back in January of 2022. I've always wanted to do this particular video uh, as something special. And seeing as how Glenn just did what he did and uh, put a false copyright strike against me, I think that rates enough as a special event because, you know, what? it takes a special kind of person to uh, do that kind of thing, especially when they already know the rules of the game. He probably thought he was going to try to bully me off here. But you know what? That hasn't worked before. So, Glenn, why don't you go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Well, at least try to enjoy the show. I know the rest of my audience will. Blocking the roadway. If it was my car, I'd be towed. I'd be towed instantly on the main road. Guess some people have special privileges. <laughs> he saw me. No, oh, Glenn, he didn't see you. He heard you walking down the street. I mean, your thunderous uh, footsteps uh, are quite hard to miss with that giant frame of yours. Glenn, you shaved. I did. You did. I, I did, yep. There you go. What's your name? Officer Goddess, Seven Police, oh, okay. 1472. What are you looking for? You were looking uh, me up and down. Was that like a? Huh? What were you looking for with your eyes? You were scanning me. I was. No, oh. I'm looking for you. Oh, okay. Did the police cause the accident? Did the police run you off the road? Oh. Uh, no, Glenn, you, uh, rotund moron. Uh, the police didn't run her off the road. That much is clear from the way the accident looks. It looks like just a, uh, person who wasn't paying a bit of attention to where they were going, probably on their cell phone at the time, and ended up rear-ending another vehicle. So... It happens, but you certainly are ready to blame the police for something they didn't do. Every is really bad, just so you know. They're really bad people. I'm not interested, thank you. Oh, okay. So much 
later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. What's that? I can't hear you. What's that? Stay on the sidewalk. Stay on the sidewalk? Yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm, I think I'm off the sidewalk. I think I'm off the sidewalk. <laughs> I think I was off the sidewalk there for a minute. Because you, you asked me a question, right? So stay on the sidewalk. Or what? Or what? Stay on the sidewalk. Okay, leprechaun. Or what? Four leaf clover. What are you going to do? Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, go back in your car like a little good girl. girl. Yeah. You know, uh, this video was about an hour long, so I am just going to go ahead and skip to the part where he harasses the tow truck driver and uh, call it after that because I don't think he wants to stick around for the whole video because who wants to see an entire hour of Glenn Serio acting like a complete dumbass? I mean, it's entertaining, but eventually you get tired of it. One frozen wasteland later. Your boy said I was at his truck, but I don't think he owns that company, right? Wait, you don't own that company, right? So I can call your manager and report you because you said it's your company, right? Yeah, that's the way it works. That is the way it works, man. It must suck to work forever, Petey. Uh, yeah. Hey, you're all talk, buddy. You're all talk. Yeah, go back in. Shut up. Yep. Shut up. All talk. Everybody's talk. Nobody's action. If they were action, we'd be doing something right now. You know, like I could just slip these shoes off like this real quick. You know, Glenn, the only one I hear talking around here is you. Everybody else is uh, doing their job, which means they're the ones who are all action. So I think you got it in reverse right there, a gibbering idiot. And we could go, you know? We could move a lot faster like that, you know? We, we could do like a, you know, like a kind of, you know, we could do that, you know? You know what that means, right? <laughs> A lot, of, a lot of officers uh, say I'm too close to them. Do you feel like I'm too close? Is it bothering you? A lot of officers say I stand on their gun side, so I'll move to this side. That way you think I'm not trying to go for your your weapon there. Uh, feel better? You feel better? Less nervous? I'm trying to make you, you comfortable. I'm trying to make you feel comfortable. We're, we're just going that way. I'm not gonna let you walk behind. Oh, okay, well, you can just keep going. Yeah. That guy, I think that guy's got a problem though. Should we go deal with him? <laughs> yeah. You look nervous, man. What happened to you? What? What happened to you? You changed. You changed in seconds. Yeah, so this guy says that this is his company and this is his truck, right? He was saying that, uh, Stay away from his truck. Wait, back up, man. Well, I'm, I'm going this way. I'm on the spot. Right. Don't touch. You're back up. Or what? I'm high risk, so stay, stay back. Okay. You're not wearing your mask. You're high risk? Okay. You're high risk. Okay. So he's asking you to step back. I want so you to stay away from well, we're, I'm on a public easement. I'm on a public easement. Well, Glenn, duh. There's a, uh, old saying that I'm quite used to whenever I was going to accident scenes many years ago. If you're not part of the solution, then you are part of the problem. And you are being quite the little problem child here. But of course, that's just classic Glenn right there. Always wanting to be the center of attention. Always well willing to be part of the problem rather than a solution to the problem. By the way, Glenn, I wonder what you're doing since you're kind of in semi-YouTube retirement right now. I mean, uh, you're not exactly causing problems for anybody right now. And I consider that a uh, copyright strike you did against me a mild irritation at best. I'm on a public easement, okay? I'm on a public easement. Okay, but local mandates. What's that? Local well, mandates. And I want you to stay away Or what? Or what? Or what? What? I want you to stay away from me. Hey, you, so you I can do my job. Do your job. I'm, how, I'm more than six feet away from you. Right now, when I go over there and throw the strap on, you're going to be within six feet. That's your problem, not mine. That's your problem, not mine. 
That's your problem, not mine. Yeah, you want to do it, You let's do it. Let me know, buddy. Let me know. Can you get him away from Let me place? know. Let me know. Yeah, you're shaking, motherfucker. I'm not going nowhere. Let he can walk around. Let him work. Don't tell me what let to do. Work. If he wants to walk around, let him work. I'm not in his way. Yeah, I'm you, not in this way. Go ahead and stand back here. I'm not, I'm go not going nowhere. Here. No. Yes. I refuse. Yes. No, I don't have to. Go I'm on a right public there. easement. Okay. I'm on a public easement. So we need to be able to tow these cars so we can open I'm the roadway. I'm not stopped. Do, does it look like I'm physically interfering? Back up. You're, you're within back a up, foot man. of me. No, I'm not. Back up. Man. I refuse. Back up, man. I refuse. Back up. I refuse. Man. I refuse. Not doing it. Not doing it. You can stand in my face all day, I'm not going nowhere. Can you throw this other stop? I'm not going nowhere. Can you throw this other stop? I'm not going nowhere. This is my right, and you're not going to trample on my rights. You know, I'm just going to end the video right here because, well, we've had enough of Classic Glenn for the day. I mean, through time and space, I could practically smell him through my computer screen, and it is nauseating, to say the least. And plus, we all know what happens here in the end. Glenn just walks away without getting arrested anyway. But you know what? Uh, his channel is suffering anyway because, well, he's just not making as much content as he used to. And, uh, well, it's going to be a dead channel eventually. And this is all he knows how to do anyway. He certainly can't make any other types of videos like a lot of other people can. I mean, Hell, he's probably sitting in the men's shelter crying about the good old days when he used to uh, be the king of Everett, Washington, just walking around, uh, putting the police in their place in his own little fantasy world. Yeah, yeah, Glenn, we all know that you have this little fantasy world you live in. Whatever, dude. At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.